this is ultrasound of the gold barrel that is filled with sludge and uh, this is the gold barrel and the, oh, and the lumen should have been as black as you see this area whereas the lumen is filled with mixed eco next level ecogen ecogenic particles and like particles this is the, this is the sludge in the gallbladder. Now this is the portal vein, the landmark for the identification of the portal vein and this is the common bile duct. It is now the common bile duct measures 4.9 and uh, the common bile duct should not uh, exceed more than 7 with intact gallbladder. So now you see this view. In this view you see that the wall is thick and uh, rather muffled anterior wall. It measures 5.6, should not exceed 3 millimeters, maximum 4. These are the calculi and these ecogenic areas giving posterior shadowing are consistent with the calculi in the urinary, in the gallbladder. Now this is the wall of the gallbladder. This is the wall of the gallbladder. Thick up to 5.6. This is the level normal. This is the portal vein. And these ecogenicity is giving posterior shadow. This is the shadow. This is the shadow. This is the shadow. Now this is a case of uh, now in transfer section. Okay, let's see in transfer section. This is the transfer section of the urinary of the gallbladder where you see a small amount of fluid is seen around the medial wall of the and uh, this is the gallbladder thick wall filled with echoes up to here and this is the fluid this is the fluid this area where I am adding the arrows these this is fluid, pericholecystic fluid. This is called pericholecystic fluid, and this fluid is not clear. It contains echoes, white ecogenic areas. You see, these are echoes suggestive of infective in nature. The GB wall is thick, up to in this section 4.5, and uh, the lumen is filled with sludge with debris and this is a case of pericholecystitis with enzyme of the gallbladder. This is uh, the gallbladder outlet obstruction has to be removed. There is no evidence of intrahepatic bile ductectasia though the liver is fatty and light and fatty this is the transverse view you can see the kidney with renal vein entering into it so no evidence of intrahepatic bile duct atasia. the only finding is that it relates to the gallbladder and this is a finding that is consistent with the gallbladder alkali with sludge with thick walls so acute polycystitis pericholecystitis and impending mucosal, rather mucosal of the gallbladder. Gallbladder is though not distended, so I am saying uh, a distended uh, uh, impending uh, mucosal. Thank you.